A very pleasant good day, my beloved brothers and sisters in Christ and outside the body of Christ. Well, once again, this is your Christian brother Eric Braxton speaking to you all from his beloved country, the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago, on the Sabbath day, Saturday, in the month, in this brand fresh new year. Happy to New Year's to mankind. Happy New Year 2023 to mankind, the churn of men, every all over the world, the human family that God brings into existence for his honor and his glory. But before he bring the human family into existence, he bring the angels into existence before mankind. So I can't leave out the angels, I have to mention them first and mankind after. Because if I mention man first and leave out the angels, I'll be making a terrible mistake. And I don't want to make that mistake, ladies and gentlemen. Having said so, ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> boys and girls everywhere, throughout the international community, throughout the international landscape, welcome. Eric Braxton, I already post a video on my YouTube account, YouTube platform, social media platform. The name of that video, ladies and gentlemen, was um, Let the Try That Public City Stunts. They will fail. If my memory serves me right, Let the Try That Public City Stunt, they will fail. Of course, miserably in the process, but I didn't put miserably, but it means all that included, of course. Let the try that public city stunt, they will fail. What do I mean by that, boys and girls all over the world? This video is a part two to the follow-up of that part one video. And I want to add more information and travel along further afield on that road and that teaching. And arrive at appropriate conclusion. Having said so, boys and girls, let us get in the meat of the matter as quickly as possible. You know, I ended that video that they tried that public city stand. I ended that video by saying the, con the sheriff, the sheriff, or the commissioner of police, or the chief constable, whether it be in England, or in Australia, or New Zealand, or in Canada, I think the commissioner is the chief constable because all of them are under the Queen. Ephraim. Having said so, um, but another country commissioner of police and all these things, and secretary of defense and all these things. In case that's, um, that is, um, in case that commissioners of police in all different countries. Okay. I said the commissioner of police and his men continued the investigation and they did locate, when they look at the photograph where, they, where, where, the, where his men who bury the guy who claiming to be the Messiah, they found certain trees. And they think they could they could find the spot where they create um this by, the, by locating this tree, they could find the exact location this by they bury the guy. So they could exhume his, exhume his body and give it to the, his family so they could have a proper 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 burial. But I want to update you ladies and gentlemen now these terms that I'm using is an analogy. These are just these are just classical example to drive home a principle in part of this teaching. But I did say in the video, if any of them dare to carry out that public city stand literally as I explain it, they will still fail. So the examples I'm using but maybe they bury him and the grave and the cross, they just analogies. They just, they just call it parables or examples to drive home a further deeper meaning. The principle. Right. You know, unfortunately, ladies and gentlemen, the chief constable, whether it be in England, he commit that public city stand, or whether it be in the Caribbean or any part of the world, the commissioner of police, unfortunately, he and his men, detective, they haven't found the body. Five years have passed, ladies and gentlemen, and I hear the commissioner of police, he have faced the press conference for the chief constable, have faced the press, con faced the press, of course, the journalists, to give them an update in the investigation, and hear what the chief constable have to say, whether it be in England, the carrier that stunt, or any other part of the world. Hear what the commissioner of police and the chief constable have to say. 
Well, unfortunately, the ladies and gentlemen, we did not locate the exact spot where his men bury that guy who died on the cross claiming to be Jesus Christ. The men who he paid to murder him. Well, he said he'd arise from the dead. He have not rise as yet. We know the true Jesus Christ, according to the Bible, raised from the dead. And the disciples saw him. The commission, the commission and the police, he have the Bible quoting from it. And he said, I grew up a Christian too, and I believe what the scripture said. But this guy claiming to be Jesus Christ, he died, but he haven't rise. And if men who kill him, he haven't appeared back to talk to them neither, or any of the people in the town in the village, and say, I'm back. So unfortunately, five years have passed. During that five years, we have tried to locate the, 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 um, the location. But unfortunately, we cannot put too much resources, money in that. Because the minister or the Secretary of Defense is not giving me money in, in other budget to, 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 to continue that search. Because we have already spent five million, um, $2 million in that search to locate. And if we continue asking more money, more resources to put in that, it will be a wild goose chase. That money could be to other mayors, other, other, for my other department. Look, my officers, they need new vehicles, sports utility vehicles. They need bulletproof vests, and a lot of the guns they use in my officers, police officers, are all dated weapons. I have to send in an order to the minister, the minister of national security, whether it be in the Caribbean or whether the secretary, whether it be in England, the secretary of defense or in America, the secretary of defense. He will look at the the order sending to and um, put in some more money. Instead of using five, that five million dollars, um, we already spent five, four million, two million dollars in that wild goose chase, and we haven't located the spot where they bury him. You, you expect me, and five years have passed. You expect me to ask for an extra three million dollars to spend on that wild goose chase? And look, my men need equipment, they need sports utility vehicles, the patrol, they need um, bulletproof breath, and they need ammunition and and um, cameras and all these things, body cameras. And I send in that order, I ask him for two million, I ask him for three million. So that money could go to my men. And therefore this investigation, looking for that guy, Mr. Abraham, we have finally decided, me and my the commissioner of police is saying, me and my executive, we have this have an urgent meeting. And me and my executive, we have come to the conclusion we will close this investigation. I inform the commissioner, the secretary of defense. And I inform the uh, if it's um in the Caribbean, uh, the the minister will national the minister of Nash, the the minister of national security. I mean the commissioner of police will say I have informed the minister of national security that I have closed that uh, that investigation. I will inform the family. Unfortunately, we haven't find this to locate him, so he cannot um, exhume his body. So you all cannot get a proper burial. And the men, we are trying to, we are trying to locate these men. But remember, they they, they had hood over their face, and it's very difficult. I was in the night time. The flimmet, and they didn't. They, 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 the the place wasn't light light brighten, lighten up so much. And the video that they record where they bury him, where they bury the guy who claimed to be Jesus Christ. In the video, they didn't they didn't use bright lights. They were more in the night time, and the little lights they was using was little torch lights. So they don't want people to see the face, and plus the, the face was um, holding up, cover the face. So we don't know who is these men. So unfortunately for the, for the family, that will be, they cannot come to a to close here. They can't bring to a close here, whisper their burial. They want the body to, to give them a proper burial, but unfortunately we haven't located the spot. And five years have passed. We spot there bury him. A lot of grass and bush maybe further grown over over this the place and it's very hard to detect whisper that place is. So unfortunately we cannot put more resources, money on that, um, while goose chase or trying to locate it. Because we already spent spent, spent two dollars and we're not going away. So that investigation has come to an end. And therefore, I will inform the family as soon as possible. Because we have bring that that investigation to a conclusion. 
and that's it at least they have tapes where he was speaking on the cross and all these things so that will be a comfort to them yes that's all i could say to the family i will address that in another press conference when i bring the family we'll hold a press conference i will discuss that of course i'll write out a formal letter explaining all these things to them you hear what the commissioner of police is saying you hear what the chief constable is saying yes what am i teaching you all ladies and gentlemen in this video boys and girls why am I bringing this to the fore, to all your heart, mind, and soul? What will you all get out of that, this teaching? Am I using this to make a mockery of my other fellow men? Yeah, of course not. I am teaching you all, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls across the board, throughout the international community, throughout the international landscape, a very pertinent lesson. I am teaching you all something that is of very importance and therefore i'm not wasting all your time in the process but i'm teaching you all something that you all need to know that you you all need need to learn that you all need to be knowledgeable of and that lesson what i'm teaching you all remember this is a second video related to the video that already posted my youtube account and the title of that video is if they try that publicity stunt, it will fail. This is a part two related to that part one video. Concerning what? To the first to the to the first timers who are seeing this video. Relating to what? To the guy who on the cross who was saying he was Jesus Christ. And claiming to be the Messiah. Is he the Messiah? Is he Jesus Christ? No. Did he know when he was claiming that on the cross that he's not Messiah? He know that, but he was still claiming that. Fooling himself and want to fool the world. What will he benefit in that? Fooling himself or no? In spite he know he's not the Messiah, telling the people he's the Messiah, at the same time he know he's not the Messiah, but wants people to accept he's the Messiah. Now we pay the five men, his men, to kill him, murder him. The five men, he, before he make a hundred thousand dollars withdrawal from the account, you know? uh -huh. the commissioner police reveal that, you know? the chief counsel, chief constable reveal that in the press council conference because they do the investigation. Each man get a cut, but we don't know how much money out of that hundred thousand, how much is five men get, but they, they split up that money. Okay, okay, okay. Now they have murdered him and bury him. Did he rise from the grave? No. But the true Jesus Christ rise from the grave. Showing you. Teaching you all. There is only one Jesus Christ. And what the Bible already said. Jesus Christ speak about himself. He will live. He will die. And resurrect. It's only God could say that. That's what I'm teaching you all. This is what I'm teaching you all ladies and gentlemen. So since you all understand it now. Let me repeat it a million times. But you know. I don't have the luxury time to repeat that a million times. But this is the core of the matter. If you read the four synopsis gospel, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, throughout the scriptures, Jesus Christ telling the disciples, I will die. I will go up to Jerusalem. They will spit upon me. They will mock me. The Pharisees and the Sadducees and the elders will crucify me, mock me, spit upon me, reject me, crucify me, but I'll rise from the third day. No, no mere mortal man can make that can't say that about himself that is what i'm teaching you all you all now understand it ladies and gentlemen no man that is born or come in this world cannot make that claim about himself it's only god could do that <laughs> and that's why that could only make that claim could only make by one person which is jesus christ himself because he was god in human form incarnate in the flesh come through mary the virgin mary of course, we're not the process of sex because Mary didn't have sex. But he come because God don't have sex. That's why he couldn't have sex. Could not tell, that's why Mary couldn't have sex because God does not have sex. I will teach you all that in the next video to come. But let us leave that for the now. Now, yes, God is a sexless being. All of doesn't know that? Sexless being. God does not have sex. Oh, let them know that. Oh, I will reveal that to you all in due time. In due time, leave, let's leave that. Let us leave that at that juncture for the time. We'll deal with that matter in due course of time. But let me bring to the conclusion of this video. 
because I think the Commissioner of Police have more things to say. So let me try to wrap up as quickly as possible, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Now, <coughs> it's only Jesus Christ could make that claim. And that's why Jesus Christ tells his disciples he will die resurrect. And in fact, he died. The disciples witnessed it. The mob, the Jewish mob witnessed it. Pontius Pilate and all of them see when he died. Yes. The soldiers took him with the sword. Blood and water come out. Yeah, they bury him, Joseph. <coughs> and he redirected the third day and he went and paid the disciples. Mm -hmm. But that man on the cross who was claiming to... Why he didn't do the same thing like Jesus Christ? On the record, the video, he didn't do that. People see the video. We talking that talk on the cross. But they was waiting a couple of days to see if he didn't come back and pay. All now they're waiting and he have not come back. Even the commissioner of police waiting for him to come back and he had come back. Because he was not Jesus Christ. He's a mere man. And I'm simply saying, any man who claiming to be Messiah want to crash, carry out that public city stand in the literal way, how I teaching it in the video, they will fail because in the first place they is not Christ, in spite of saying they are Christ. That's what I'm teaching you all, boys and girls, across the border. You see, Jesus Christ is God in human form when he was saying that. So that's why he could accomplish that. That's the difference. That's the difference, ladies and gentlemen. Mm -hmm. But let me use my own self as a classical example. And when I use my own self as this classical example, that applies to all mankind everywhere, whoever live or born or come in this world. Once again, let me use myself as a classical example. And when I use myself as an individual, as a classical example, when I'm speaking about Eric Braxton, I'm speaking about mankind. And that applies to every human being that come in the world, which is mankind. So I'm using myself to symbolize everybody, every man and every woman. And because I'm a human being that says Adam and Eve, and all the, the people that come in the world, human beings on their own flesh and blood, that says me. Thank you. On this mankind? On his mankind? Right. Thank you all ladies and gentlemen. You all understand it now? Let us say... <coughs> let us say I began to make that false claim that I is Jesus Christ. And I say I will die and come back again. I only tell and all of that because I could talk that. But when I die, you think I'll bring myself out of the grave and appear back and say, Yeah, yes. I will not even to do that at all because in the first place I didn't create myself. And I can break my, bring myself out of no grave. And I can rec rec redirect myself. Because I is not God. I was teaching all you. Because I am just a mere man. And all mere man is the same way. Like what I just explained here. Jesus Christ was not a man. A mere man. Uh -huh. Jesus Christ was God in human form. Which means he take on human form and come up on the earth. So he is different. He is God. So that's why he can make that claim and fulfill it. That's the difference. That's what I'm teaching you all. You all understand it now? Thank you all ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world. Let us hear what the commissioner of police have to say now. Or the chief constable. They haven't found him. He haven't read a from the grave. So all what that, that man who was claiming to be the Messiah, telling the people before he went and paid the men to crucify him, all what he was telling them, was it true? It was not true. And now the people get to recognize it now. You, what he was saying is not true. Then why did he do that? To gain what? Popularity? To be famous? It's true, he gained a little popularity and he get a little fame in the context that the men record the video and through the internet the videos are being shown all over the world. I hear the, vi the videos and they make viral now. Yeah. Getting millions of view, um, views, uh, uh, views on the, on the um, videos. It may be cost 50 million views. Mm -hmm. Viral. It may go to 100 million views just now. So he, so he get a little fame by that. Yes, he get a little popularity by that. 
yeah but with all that he's still not god and he's still not jesus christ did he come out of the grave no he's still in the grave can he bring himself out of the grave no but on the cross when he was on the cross he was telling people that he haven't fulfilled it five years have passed and he haven't come back showing he was not jesus christ and he's not god he was just a mere man just as any other man that's what i'm teaching you all ladies and gentlemen that's what i'm teaching you all ladies and gentlemen boys and girls all over the world so any man upon the earth claiming to be god or jesus christ now that apply to he this lesson apply to he mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and even self he die a natural death he still can't bring him back himself alive because he didn't make himself in the first place see what i trying to show you and even self he dare play bold face enough to carry out the public city stun in a literal way like how i explain it explain explain it to you all he still not will not redirect himself or bring back himself out of the grave because he's as he's as a mere man as any other man this is what i'm teaching you all ladies and gentlemen are you all getting something out of this boys and girls are you all understanding comprehending what i'm teaching you all i hope so in other words what i'm teaching you all in essence is only one true jesus christ could make that claim and fulfill it and you already make the claim and fulfill it according to the scriptures jesus christ and he resurrected from the dead the third day and i went and appeared to disciples and when we read in the book of acts he carried disciples to the mount of olive and ascend into heaven Huh? Yeah, 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 you got it. You see? This is what I'm telling you all, ladies and gentlemen. Well, I just want to add, I just want to say that the family, they haven't able to, Commissioner Police and his men haven't able to locate the body. So the family, at least they have the tapes and all these things, where in his speeches and in his, um, discussion uh, the man who claimed to be christ when he was talking telling the people he's the messiah he's the christ and say he will die on the cross they have all these videotapes and the family so have these video tapes to watch to watch what he was saying and all these things unfortunately they didn't able to locate the spot where the men bury him so they could exhume the body so they, they could hand over the body to the to the family to be, give him a proper bury burial unfortunately un, unfortunately the family cannot get the body unfortunately and um, as i said the, the the investigation have have come to a close concerning finding the body all you hear what the commissioner police have to say as i mentioned it in the in the, <coughs> in the video by using that example so that's it ladies and gentlemen i think i do have to um add further i think that's the conclusion that's the conclusion in this part two video related related to the first video if any of them or if any of them dare to try this public city stunt they will fail this 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 will be this video will type will be titled the same video part two in relation to part one if they dare try this public city stunt they will fail yeah this is what i'm teaching you all ladies and gentlemen do you all understand it now boys and girls everywhere do you all understand it I hope so. I hope so, ladies and gentlemen. I hope so. I hope so. I hope so. I hope so, ladies and gentlemen. I hope so that you all understand what I'm teaching you all in this video. What I'm teaching you all in this video. So that's what went on. He would draw the that guy who claimed to be the messiah he joined the five he drew a hundred thousand dollars out of his account this is a, a analogy this is a these are just examples but i have to explain it in that way ladies and gentlemen so you all understand the principle behind it so if you draw uh he would draw one hundred thousand dollars he split up the money with the five men and they went in the in a forest area and the video film everything and record everything and they they, they kill him on the cross. They have a, he did have a, a cross made out of wood and they kill him on the cross. 
but when he was on cross he was speaking and saying all sorts of things he will he will look i'll die for mankind and i'm going to share my blood for mankind i will resurrect the third day and come back and all these things all these things he was saying on the cross but did he fulfill it no five years have passed and he haven't come back you see showing you he was not jesus christ ladies and gentlemen i ask the question now you think any of these men upon the earth right now who, who, who currently saying there is Jesus Christ, you think they are you think they are boldface enough to carry out that publicity stunt? How I explain it in the scriptures in this video? I think not. Once again, let me repeat myself, ladies and gentlemen, are boys and girls all over the world throughout the international community. All these men upon the earth now who claim to be Jesus Christ. You think any of them boldface enough to try to carry out a publicity stunt like how I explain it in this video? You think any of them will ever try to do will carry out that will boldface enough to try it? Huh? Ladies and gentlemen, I ask you all the question a third time. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world. All these men who claim to be Jesus Christ, who currently are alive upon the earth right now, in 2023, you think any of them boldface enough to carry out the publicity stunt, as how I explain it in this video, part one and part two? You think any of them boldface enough to do that? And if any of them boldface enough to do that, in the literal way, how I explain it in this video, please help me, they will fail they will fail because in the first place none of them is jesus christ and none of them is, none of them is the messiah <coughs> and that's the reality about it ladies and gentlemen but i just want to go out ladies and gentlemen men and see I just want to say it, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you all understand that. But I just want to say, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to all the men upon this earth currently now who claim to be Jesus Christ, like A.J. Miller in Australia, John Miller, A.J. Miller in Australia, the one down in Brazil, the Russian, the, the Siberian guy who claimed to be Jesus, who was a former police officer and arrest him now, all of them are my brothers yes all of them are my brothers and there are many others all of them are my brothers all of them are my brothers and you see at no time i haven't write off none of them all you're not observing this with eric Gregson. at no time i haven't write off none of them you know ladies and gentlemen we are so accustomed with this writing off thing so let me deal with a little writing off they say when a car a vehicle get damaged accident when a car when a vehicle get in an accident and the car is badly damaged in an accident or terrible damage in the accident they say they can't use the car again so they say the car is right off and hey, look the car is look the car get an accident they're pointing the car look the car or the bicycle or the motorcycle or the vehicle get in an accident look how it's a terrible damage they, they can't use that car again they can't carry it to the mechanic to fix it. It badly, it badly damaged. It right off. Now we could only use it for parts. But you know, all these men, AJ Miller, John Miller, my brother in Australia, the one down in Brazil, the Siberian guy who claimed to be Jesus Christ, my next brother, Russian brother, and others who claimed to be Jesus Christ. You know, Eric Braxton haven't right, Eric Braxton haven't right off none of them. What do I mean? Well, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't said that none of them cannot be saved, and I haven't, I have, I haven't said, I haven't said at no time that they are doomed, that they cannot be saved again by their claiming to be Jesus Christ. You know, it have some Christian quick to say that. Huh? Look, A.J. Miller saying he's Jesus Christ, he can be saved again. Mm -hmm. He's eternally lost. God can't bow. The God don't want nothing to raise Jamila again. God write you off. He can't be saved again. 
Uh, look this Iberian guy who claiming to be Jesus Christ. Some Christian quick to say that. He dumb, he dumb, he eternally dumb. He can't be saved again. God the Father and Jesus Christ have write you off. Look the things he claim about Jesus Christ. He claim he's Jesus Christ. God can save you again. He doom, he damn, he eternally damn. He cannot be saved again. Jesus Christ have write you off. Mm -hmm. The next one. And the next one. That's some Christian. Quick to sue that. I heard Braxton at any time I've said that. At no time. So I haven't write off none of them. Hope you all listening to Eric Braxton. Crystal Clear. Under the song of my voice. You all understand what I'm saying. Teaching you all Crystal Clear. Right. I Eric Braxton haven't write off none of them. I'll tell you why, ladies and gentlemen, before I bring the curtain down on this video. Because today or tomorrow, if I get a little financial wealth in my hand. Enough money, of course. <clears throat> I will fly to Australia. You think if I go to Australia, Melbourne, Australia, Sydney, Australia, and I see AJ Miller? Of course. I will go up to AJ Miller and shake his hand and embrace him here, my brother, man. Yeah. I know I don't accept what he's saying and the claims he's making, but I will embrace him and tell him he's my brother. And I love him with the love of Jesus Christ. And if I go to this Siberia and I see the, the guy who claiming to be Jesus Christ, the, the Russian guy, I will embrace him too. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I tell him I don't accept the claims of me again. But I love you with the love of Jesus Christ and my brother. You understand? And the one in dog in Brazil too. I'll tell all of them the same way too. The same thing. Well, without that, well, I better believe what Eric Braxton are telling you all. Because if I go to these countries and I see these guys, that's exactly what I'll be doing. Well, without that, eh? All right. Well, you all will see the proof of it because when I go to this country, I'll have my cameraman filming it and documenting it and posting it to the internet for all you to see what I've been telling you all. But I have, that is left to be seen. <coughs> yeah, you see? So I haven't write off any of them. A lot of Christians will disagree with me. <coughs> A lot of the Christians will disagree with me. And you know what they will disagree with me? Classical example. Here what they will say. Eric Braxton, you can't be no true Christian. You claiming to be a Christian. You are so-called charlatan, a false teacher. Because Jesus Christ said, these messiahs don't even go and see them. Hmm? If they say he's in the desert, go not after them. If they say he's in secret chambers, believe them not. On Jesus Christ said so? Yes, I know it's exactly what Jesus Christ said. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That, is, that is a different context. That is, Christ is talking about people who want to seek out these guys, these guys, and believe there is the Messiah. Like a lot of people live in America and all over the world and going to Australia and want to be next to AJ Miller and accept him as Christ and, be, and living close to him. And listening to this teaching and going, that is that in a different context. That is the context Jesus Christ was talking about. Uh -huh. Are you not doing that? Are you not going to Australia to meet a Joe Miller to say, You is Jesus Christ? I come, I leave Trinidad to come here to live to be close to you. You is the Messiah? No. But I mean, if I in, if I in Australia and I'm in the same proximity with um, a Joe Miller and I see him. Of course, I'll go up and talk to him. It's in that context I'm talking about. There's a difference there, ladies and gentlemen. And the same one in, in um, Russia. So it's a different context there. Understand that context. And the one down in Brazil. And many others. If I do meet all of them. Or at least half of them. Or three or three or four of them. There's a different context. If I go down to Brazil and I see that one with the women and them, all the women with them, I'm not telling them I come here and accept you as Christ. I come down here to live with you, to be with you, or to follow you. Of course not. But if I'm in the close proximity 
Oh, yeah, in the city of Brazil, and I see passing through with the women and them on the chariots. Yeah, you know, there's little Mapo in the car with the women and them. Of course, I will stop him and have a little chat with him. And tell him, I do accept you to be used, no Jesus Christ. I will tell him that you don't know Jesus Christ. But in that sense, I'll talk to him. It's in that context I talk about. So there's a difference. Uh -huh. There's a difference. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. That one in down in Brazil, I'll say you are not Jesus Christ, but you are my brother. I I point and then I'll point him to the true Jesus Christ. That one down in Brazil, I'll point him to the true Jesus Christ. You see the difference? And the one in Russia, I will embrace him. I'll tell him you are not Jesus Christ. But you is my brother. And I'll point him to the true Jesus Christ too. And I'll do AJ Miller the same thing too. You see, I'll point Jesus, A.J. Miller, you are not Jesus Christ, and show him in the Bible, the true Jesus Christ. You see? So there's a difference, eh? There's a difference. So that Christian who was saying, Eric Braxton, you for not following the Bible, because you're going to look for these men. You're going to look for these men. I'm not going to look for them. I say if I go to the country and I'm in close proximity, unfortunately, if I happen to see them, I will not pass them, but I'll go to them and talk to them. Yeah. There's a difference. There's a difference. But each of them, I'll tell them there's not Jesus Christ, and I'll point them to Jesus Christ, the true Jesus Christ. There's a difference. That's the difference, ladies and gentlemen. So that's entirely in a different context by itself. You see? You see, ladies and gentlemen? Because I'll embrace all of them and tell them, show them you all are my brother. You see? And I do accept you to be Christ. The Russian one, I'll tell him. AJ Mala, I do accept you to be you, not know Jesus Christ. The one in Brazil, you are my brother, but you are not Jesus Christ. I open the Bible and show you, you see, the, you see the, the one in the Bible who died and on the cross and came back? He said, disciples according to, died the true Jesus Christ. I tell the one in Brazil that, I tell the Egemela that, and the one in Russia, I tell you that. And all the rest of them, I tell all of them that too. You all know understand it? Thank you all ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world. <coughs> have a little cold, so bear with me, ladies and gentlemen. <coughs> so, so that's the conclusion of the video, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world. You see, so the poor guy, he paid the man and the kid, with all the claims he was making, he decided to carry it out in a literal way, and he paid the man to kill him. They collect, they cut the money. And the poor guy, he haven't died for no mankind. In spite of telling people on the cross he died for mankind, he haven't died for no mankind. What his men did, murder him. That's what they do, they murder him. Yeah? Because if these men, they throw their face, who kill him? The commissioner of police are tracked down all of them and find out who is, and they charge each of them for murder for killing that guy on the cross. In spite he paid them to do that. It's still wrong. They are charged all these four five men for killing them. That's why they burn up, they hide their face. Because they understand that. That's why they didn't show their face. You see? <laughs> In the video. You see? You see? These are just analogy, analogy, analogies I use in examples to drive home a principle. And I explain the principle. I hope you all grasp it and understand it. So that's it, brothers and sisters. That's it, that's it. I don't have to add anything further to that. I think that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. That's the core of the video. That's the core of the video, ladies and gentlemen. That's the core of the video. That's the core of the video, man. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world, that's the core of the video. Mm. That's the core of the video. Mm. <coughs> mm. 
That's the, that's the meat of the matter, ladies and gentlemen. That's the fuck of the matter. <coughs> in no other name, but in the mighty name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Shalom, peace. See you all in the next video soon. Bye-bye, my friends. Bye-bye, my friends. Well, that's it. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it for this video. That's it for this video, man. That's it for this video. I think I did cover a lot, I mostly all the areas that I need to cover in this um, teaching concerning that. Yes, yes, yes. Perhaps I might have a part three or oh, part three. Uh, but we let us wait and see. Let us put that on hold for the time. Yes, yes. Let us put that on hold for the time. But for now, for now, I think that's the conclusion of it. That's the conclusion of it. That's the conclusion of it. That's and the only way I'll have a part three in this is if is if is if they're not finding the body. Not so much the, not so much the police, but the from the hunters going in the bush to hunt and they come across a grave and they locate and inform the authorities. That's only how if that happened I'll have a part three. But if that doesn't happen, don't if that doesn't happen, don't look out for no part three part two this video here will be the conclusion of the whole matter i thank you all ladies and gentlemen boys and girls in all the name but in the mighty name of jesus christ shalom peace see you all in the next video soon bye bye my friends